Hi everyone, it's Michael Dougal with Remax Premier and I appreciate you tuning in to watch this short message where this video is going to be your guide for assignment sales. We're going to talk about what is an assignment sale and we're going to go over the advantages of an assignment sale for not only the buyer but the seller as well. But before we begin, I'm wondering who you may know that could use my help either buying, selling or investing residentially here in the greater Toronto area. Call me, call me, call me. My phone number is 416-671. 5218 or alternatively if you prefer to communicate via email then be sure to email me at michael at mdougal.com um, let's get right into the video all right so what is an assignment sale an assignment is when a seller is selling their interest in a property before they take possession of it so in other words they're selling the contract they have with the builder to a new project to another purchaser when a seller assigns a property they're not really selling the property because they don't own it yet but more so they're selling their promise to purchase it along with the rights and the obligations that are there in the agreement of purchase and sales. So the buyer of an assignment is essentially stepping into the shoes of the original purchaser to the project. Some people who buy a pre-construction condo, they may not want to close, but instead they may sell it to another buyer as an assignment. You may wonder why anybody would want to assign their agreement. It's likely because personal circumstances just have arisen. Maybe somebody decided to buy in a particular area and then they had a job transfer and they no longer have any interest in buying in that area or maybe they bought it for one of their kids and their kids is against going to that area or maybe something happened with the kids schools that takes them elsewhere so these things happen or sometimes people just decide to do a flip they may invest into a particular project only to realize that it's really gone up in value and that they're more beneficial just cashing out of it what are the advantages so the advantages for a buyer of an assignment sale is there's three main advantages and let's go over them. Um, the first is that right now there's a shortage of resale condos. So therefore, having your eyes open to assignment sales just naturally gives you more inventory to choose from. Um, the second advantage is that you will rarely get into multiple offer situations just because there's less buyers. Less buyers know about assignment sales and less buyers actually feel safe going ahead with assignment sales. And the third benefit is that you'll likely be buying it at a discount. Let's face it, when somebody's selling a property on assignment, in most cases, they really want it sold. They fit into that category of people that are almost like desperate sellers and they just want out of the project. So a buyer who knows about this, they can really capitalize and take advantage of this. Although unfortunately for most people looking to assign their property, the builder may not allow you to put it on the MLS. Therefore, you may have to just rely on like word of mouth marketing or you may find it helpful to put it up on Kijiji, Craigslist or maybe the Facebook marketplace. So I hope you found all this information helpful regarding assignment sales. Again, if there's any questions you have towards this topic or there's anything I can do to help regarding buying, selling or investing residentially here in the greater Toronto area, please do call me, call me, call me. Uh, my customers, they get excellent service. My phone number is 416 671 5218 or alternatively you can communicate to me again via email at michael at mdougal.com uh, be sure to go ahead and share this video with anyone you may know that may find the information helpful do be sure to click like and comment i review all comments and i really appreciate them and i will look forward to seeing you all next time